Good afternoon. I'm Claire Crouch in for Chris and Dia. The search for evidence in connection to a 42 year old disappearance continues today. Multiple police agencies are out this morning in Mercer County searching for clues into the whereabouts of Melanie Flynn. Lee Searcy has more in the LEX 18 big story at noon. Lexington Police and Kentucky State Police are back here again searching for possible evidence in the Melanie Flynn case. We're here at Murphy's Landing along the Kentucky River. That is private property, so that is why we are staying up here. But as you can see, officers have been here most of the morning. Today, canines have been busy sniffing around some freshly dug up areas at this old campground. As we told you Monday, police received a very credible tip that Flynn's remains could be buried in an underground tank here. I'm told that tip came from someone who apparently wanted to get a secret off his chest. We'll just leave it at that. Melanie Flynn vanished in early 1977, and many believe that she knew too much about the bluegrass conspiracy, a multi-million dollar drug ring in the 70s involving some dirty Lexington police officers and well-connected members of the community. Now, why this location? Well, sources tell me some of the key players in the bluegrass conspiracy had ties to this area back in the day. It really says something about the dedication into this case. KSP and Lexington police still working very diligently to try and bring Melanie Flynn home to her family in Lexington. Again, officers have been here most of the morning. We will stay here and of course we'll bring you the very latest coming up later today in Mercer County. Lee Searcy, LEX 18 News. Lee